quite good, the growth. Uh, it's no signs of contamination, quite healthy. Same as this. You can see the older agar on the top. No signs of contamination. Because we poured it so thick, we can always scrape a layer off of it to get rid of any contamination, or we can scrape a layer off of it to transfer it. And then you'll have more mycelium growing on this again. Versus if you used a petri dish, most of the time if you cut it, it's in a very thin layer that that essentially exposes the bottom of the, the tray array. So you'd have no, no more surface area. So, so there's a, so that's the kind of, I guess, pros and cons of using different materials. Um, I personally like to use these trays because they're just a lot more readily accessible and they're just more environmentally friendly because um, you can use these multiple times if you wanted to and you can also pr pressure cook these so that's the other thing so you can always reuse these types of plastics versus if you used a polystyrene you would have to throw it away it's a single-use plastic 